1934, Shirley Temple was awarded a special miniature Oscar for her outstanding <laughs> contribution to the silver screen. Thank you wow. very much. Wow. 1934, man. Wow. See, that is thing about being on video. If you do things that you see on video, you get to see your, ex your life, you get to experience yourself, see yourself at every point of, of, of life growing. Mommy, can I go home now? For three straight years, she led the box office. A drink was named after her, and children copied her curls. Shelly Temple, man. Awesome. When she did grow up, her popularity declined. At 17, a popularity. Okay, why? She married John Agar, who she starred with in a couple of films. How do you do? Yeah, I know you're a child star. You can't kind of grow up now. You know, things might happen. But Shirley Temple would leave that marriage and her Hollywood career, marrying a San Francisco businessman. Oh, see how she looks now, Shirley Temple and entering the world of politics under the first wow she hell president bush she served as ambassador to czechoslovakia and before that ambassador to wow what a life ambassador to ghana but even in her later years ghana! she was most recognized as the quintessential child star my thanks to the industry for helping me to have an enchanted and very busy childhood. No, your childhood was really, really busy, man. What? I, I'm really enchanted. What? A childhood full of happy <laughs> memories. I never had what? to work very hard, she once said. <laughs> we all just seemed to play games. Wow. Oh my God. <laughs> I hope I'm not saying too much more about man. She's really amazing. It's beautiful. Holiday. Brandy Hitt, ABC News, Los Angeles. Sleep well, Mama. You lived, lived a wonderful life, man. You lived a wonderful life. So now let's go back to our Macaulay Culkin stuff. So. Gained substantial influence in Hollywood because for studio executives to reach Macaulay, they needed to go through Kit. In 1993, Premiere Magazine rated Kit Culkin the 48th most powerful person in Hollywood. Ahead of Michael Douglas and Eddie Murphy. Studio executive Wow. Michael Douglas and Eddie Murphy. complained that Kit tried to use his power to seize creative control of Macaulay's movies. Because of this controlling nature, Kit was making enemies quickly. Little did hey. they know that Macaulay Culkin's career at age 12 just peaked, and it was all downhill from here. The Damn! Damn! Son was a thriller where Mac plays the role of Henry, a psychopathic child who kills yeah. people. The film yeah. did sixty million dollars in the worldwide box office. Terrible child. Ah, oh, good son. Ah, oh, terrible child. Office, which seems like a massive step down since Home Alone, but considering a totally different movie genre and not based on Christmas, I would say yeah. it's still good numbers. Mac know, was still right? beloved for his acting, and most of the negative reception was based on the plot. By 1993, Macaulay was. Yeah, but that movie was deep, yeah. Was just tired and desperately told his father he needed a break. He just wanted to go to school. He said, yeah, sure. And the next thing I knew, I was on the next set doing the next thing. And it just kind of clicked in my brain. Okay, there's basically nothing I can do to make this stop. I was making God knows Damn. Hmm. how much money. And Kit was making me sleep on the couch just because he could. Just to let you know who's in charge. And just to let you know, if he doesn't want you to sleep in a bed, you're not going to sleep in a bed. The nutcracker. So people are just wicked, just wicked for no for no reason, just just feed their ego. Cracker, getting even with dad, the page master, Richie Rich. These next The Page Master. This is a movie I want to watch. Four movies all released. Wait, wait, you wait, know, wait. If he doesn't want you to sleep in a bed, then you're not going movies. to sleep in a bed. The nutcracker getting even with dad. Getting even with dad. They're not crack. Dad, the page master, Richie Rich. The page master, huh? Some looks, looks like it goes to be mass. Awesome. Rich. 
these next four movies all released in 1994, and evidently, the world was sick of Macaulay Culkin. He hmm. was cashing in an $8 million salary for each film, which is equivalent to about $16.5 million in 2023 value. 